Hey guys, welcome to the show. Today, we are gonna turn this MacBook Pro 16 inch into a Mac Pro destroying fiend. We are gonna upgrade this beauty and make it faster than fast. But guys, Windows users, I have right here, this is a Razer Blade Stealth. 13 inch 10th generation Intel CPUs. And yes, you can also apply this mod to one of these bad boys, turning these laptops into Mac Pro destroyers. Get ready to return your Mac Pro, because the MacBook Pro now has wheels. So first up, just warning here, this may void your warranty. Check your government, check your regulations and rules, because if you follow this guide, yeah, be warned, Apple may not accept a repair for this. Now, I went to my local Bunnings workshop and I got one of these, check this out. Boom, shakalaka, flies all over on the ground. And the reason why I got a dolly instead of individual wheels, which they sell about four dollars each, super cheap, is because check out the airflow here. It's got a hole right here to get airflow, cooling, all these kind of maximum velocity fits perfectly on this MacBook Pro. Boom, shakalaka here. Imagine the performance. So in our export tests on the MacBook Pro with wheels, we found that exporting Final Cut footage was the same. All right, first off, to get this modification going, you just need to do a bit of damage on to the system, and then you spray on some wood glue, making sure that it sticks solid and tight. Now, I was gonna get the bigger one, but I decided that I don't need that much because I'm only modifying one case. Once you've got it applied, make sure you place it on the right location, so you want the open up the screen and place it to the hole on the dolly to make sure that it's perfectly symmetrically aligned because once it sticks it is stuck for good and then close the lid let it settle for a few hours and then you're ready ready to run this macbook pro through the future it can even go off road Whew, amazing macbook pro versus mustang race off in the next video all right, couple of notes, guys. When you do have your MacBook Pro attached to the wheelie, opening the lid can be a bit tricky, so just be careful when using it on your desk, but it is possible to check it out. It did open up, and using the keyboard and touch bar, it can be a bit wobbly, but it operates a lot cooler, and look at that, the airflow, the whole amazing modifications there. And look how it goes, it glides now, it moves. This portable has become super portable. You see the problem with the Mac Pro, it is just too heavy. When I put the wheels on the Mac Pro, like you have to constantly give it tension and pressure to move the beast, even with wheels, you have to constantly push it. However, with the Mac Pro, check it out, it slides. It slides in a distance. And while you do get insanely better performance with wheels on the MacBook Pro, got some disappointing news for you Apple fans. This Razer Blade Stealth actually goes a lot faster with these wheels. Check the side-by-side -side comparison. That's almost double the performance on the MacBook Pro. I was shocked, I was surprised. I was getting ready to return my MacBook Pro to Apple. Until I realized I was out of my 14 day returns policy. So I'm stuck with this beast. But guys, I hope you found this video useful and let me know what kind of amazing modifications you guys are doing to your 16 inches out there. Hope you guys enjoyed the show.